hello everyone welcome back again hope you are doing good hope you are doing well all your families in today's video we're going to continue our abacus finger counting and um yeah well in case you are new here my name is Seiba. i am an educator and a food vlogger based in lagos nigeria so you are absolutely welcome to this channel kindly subscribe if you haven't for the returning subscribers thanks for sticking to this channel I really appreciate now in the previous lesson we continued our abacus we counted from 50 to 99 and we did some practice questions so in today's lesson we're going to be doing something different here yeah, we are advancing now so I would like to cite one example first so we can um, understand what we want to learn in this lesson 4 plus 2 plus 2 plus 1 now let's look at it. Four, one, two, three, four, plus two. How will I add the two? Another two again. There's another one. And there's nothing on this finger again, just this five. So what am I going to do? To so add the two and the two and the one. So that's what we're going to be learning in this lesson. So keep watching. Yeah, I felt it was too close, so I made it far. Now we have this small friend formula small friend formula now we are dealing with addition here this small friend formula is like one to four and um you need to understand the way you can understand is look at this number one two three four because we are dealing with only one place don't forget these are one unit each and this palm this right palm represents units so we have one to four now you see this one to four one two three four one two three four the small friend so the see this formula is like this the the friend of one is four so this is how you understand the friend of one is four one and four they are best friends they are close friends the friend of two is three because in this case, we want to get five. We want to get five. So, two plus three will give us five, right? Three plus two will give us five. Four plus one will give us five. One plus four will give us five. So, it means one and four, they are friends. Two and three, they are friends. Three and two, they are friends. And four and one, they are friends. So, which means if um one needs help it's going to seek for help from four not from three if two needs help it's going to seek for help from three if three needs help three is going to seek for help from two so that's how that's how you understand now look at this formula it's not hard it's not hard all you need is watch carefully and practice practice a lot now we have the addition here you know we are not dealing with subtraction the subtraction is easy if you understand the addition now we have plus one plus two plus three plus four plus two plus three plus four means to add one what will you do to add two what will you do to add three what will you do and to add four what will you do so the thing that will help you is no each number's friend was the friend of this one was a friend of two was a friend of three and was a friend of four that's only we can understand so here look at this case here four plus two i have four here how will i add two how will i add two i know two is a friend of three right so i want to go and seek up from three from three rather so how will i add a three now this is what we're going to do this is the formula to add one you add five first and you take away four yes because four if you are a friend of someone you should be able to sacrifice for your friend down so four wants to sacrifice itself for one so to add one you add five and you take away four so which means 
5 minus 4 equals to 1. 5 minus 4 equals to 1. So to add 1, you add 5 first. You bring up 5 first and you take away 4. Do you understand? Let me know in the comment section. Now, to add 2. This is why I teach my pupils personally. So to add 2, you still add 5 because we are in the 5 place. We are in the unit place. 5 is the is like the key here. This palm is 5. So to add 2, you add 5. Which number will you take away now? What's the friend of 2? 3. So you take away 3. So 5 minus 3 is 2. So 3 wants to sacrifice itself. Let me go. Just for 2. So to add 3. If you need 3. There is no more 3. You, you need 3. Look at this for 1, 2, 3, 4. And I want to add 3. What will you do? You add 5. And you take away 2. I hope you can see. I hope, I hope you can all see this. Because 5 minus 3 is 3. So to add 4. To add 4. You add 5 again. And you take away 1. Because 4 and 1, they are friends. 4 and 1. See, the thing, what you need to do here is, what you need to understand here is that the numbers that will give you 5 on this right palm, addition. The numbers that can give you 5. 3 and 2, 5. 2 and 3, 5. 4 and 1, 5. 1 and 4, 5. So you can just, it's just the arrangement that is changing here. So to add 1, I will add 5 first and I will bring down 4. To add 2, add 5 and bring down 3. To add 3, add 5, bring down 2. To add 4, add 5, bring down 1. Do you understand? Now, let's practice. I hope you all understand. Now, look at this first question. 5, 1, 2, 1. 5 plus 1 plus 2 plus 1. 9. I don't need to borrow. The answer is 9. Look at the second one. 4, 1, 2, 3, 4 plus 2. So to add 2, what will you do? Let's go back to our formula. To add 2, I'm going to add 5 and bring down 3. 1, 2, 3. Plus 2 again. 1, 2. Plus 1. The answer is 9. Please, if you use your calculation, is this right or wrong? So since we have our fingers, let's, let's make use of this nature. Let's teach our kids. Now, Another example here. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2. 1 plus 2. 1, 2. Plus 3. What's the friend of 3? 2. So to add 3, I'm going to add 5 and bring down 2. It's 2 that I want to sacrifice. Yes. Plus 2. 1, 2. The answer is what? 5, 6, 7, 8. Do you understand? Hope you're understanding. <laughs> So here, 1, 3, 2, 2, 1, plus 3, 1, 2, 3, plus 2. What will you do to add 2? What's the friend of 2? 3. So it's 3 that will go down. It is 3 that will sacrifice. So to add 3, don't just bring down 3. You add 5 first. You add 5, you bring up, you bring up 5, and you take away 3. 1, 2, 3. Plus 2 again. 1, 2. The answer is 8. This question is just like a repetition, you know. We scattered it. Just for beginners to understand. Because if you try to make new things complex to people, they will not, they will not show interest again. And it's very useful. Now, look at this one. 3, 4, 1, 1. 3, 1, 2, 3. Plus 4. To add 4, what will you do? What will you do to add 4? So you add 5 and you break down 1 because 4 is afraid of 1. So 1 will sacrifice itself for his friend. Plus 1 again plus another 1. The answer is 9. Why are we just getting 9 here? Now here we have 1, 1, 2, 5. 1 plus 1 plus 2, 1, 2 plus 5. The answer is 9. So, please go and practice. You need to practice a lot if you want this to be interesting. So, look at it again. 5, 1, 2, 1. 5, 1, 2, 1. 9. 
four two four two two one four two two one one two three two one two three two eight one three two two one three two two eight three four one one three four one one nine one one two five one one two and five nine so you have to practice this for me to add one you bring up five and you take four to add two you bring up five and you take three to add three you bring up five and you take two to add four you bring up five and you take one so i hope you find this interesting i hope you find it impactful and i hope you find it new please don't forget to subscribe F subscribe to my channel watch my videos if you have not watched the part one of this abacus finger counting please go and watch that's the only way you understand don't jump go and watch like my videos comment share help my ministry here eh? at least this month or next month we should be able to reach like maybe 30 subscribers is not so much so see you in my next video take care bye